And this is the astrological forecast for the sign of Capricorn for March 2024. Brought to you by the wonderful people at AskTheAnswer.com, the UK's leading website for tarot readers, psychics, mystics and channelers. Capricorn, um, it's all gone quiet. You can't believe it, I know. Because it seems as if all of a sudden there's no planets in Capricorn. For the first time in over a decade, well over a decade. And of course Pluto is going to come back into your sign later this year. Minorly, marginally, but still. Nevertheless, at this time, there is no direct influence on your sign, which tells me that although you're going to have difficulty doing it because you're well not going to be able to just drop everything after 10 years of living, looking over your shoulder, this is a month where you can actually start to relax a little bit, but not too much. The world's going to go a little bit crazy in the next couple of months, and whilst this is not directly impacting on you, it does suggest that um, everyone's going to be impacted and therefore you can't relax too much. But what you can do is you can drop your shoulders a little bit, open up your batteries a little bit and start recharging them. You've been living behind kind of Kevlar walls for, for, for the last few years and now this, this energy is coming to an end. So you can dare to relax a bit and recharge your batteries and reboot your soul. This is a good time to do this because you might not have time next month. And then there's a Mercury retrograde this month. And it's happening in the sign of Aries, which is a sign you've not got a lot in common with. And it's not going to affect all of you. But those of you born on the 8th of January onwards, my advice is don't, don't change course. Don't make major changes in your life. Don't suddenly radically alter plans because A, it won't work the way you expect it to and B, people will see you flip-flopping and they'll think, oh, well, they're not very decisive, are they? They're always changing their mind. So stick to your course in the second half of the month. And this is for all of you, but especially those of you born after the 8th. This is not a month of major actions. Instead, it's a month of daring to let yourself recover, daring to recharge your batteries and do so, please, whilst you still can. As far as March 24 goes, Capricorn, a very restorative month.